guys, welcome back to this video. In this video, we're gonna be making a night vision system for the game, so you can just uh, click on E, and it's gonna enable, and if you click on Q, it's gonna disable. Uh, we're gonna do this without uh, goggles. Uh, in the next video, I'm gonna be showing you how to do it with a tool. So you just click and it enables, but this time we're gonna do it with key codes and key binds. So what you wanna do is insert a uh, screen GUI and name it night vision. Oh, spell it wrong. Again. You want to insert a frame at 0, 0,255, 0, and border size pixel 100, and the same here. So you have this. Now you need to put it in the middle by anchor point 0, 0.5, 0, 0.5, 0, uh, 0, 0.5, and by the position 0, 0.5, 0, 0.5, 0, 0, 0, 0. It's going to say here. And by size 1, 0, 1, 0. Now you have this. Now this is uh, it. Click on visible off. Close this. And now you need to insert a local script. And name it night vision handler. Local user input surface. Something from Roblox where you can do keybinds uh, and all that stuff. Which is really good. Game calling get servers. User input servers. Uh, user input server. Thank you. And we're gonna do user input service dot input begun. Yes. Colon connect function enable if enable dot key code is equals equals to item dot key code dot e then uh, we need to define it. Local player is game dot players dot local player local uh p player gui well local gui is player uh, player gui local night is equals to uh gui dot night vision local frame is equals to uh night vision night dot frame and we're gonna do frame not visible is equals to true and we're gonna do frame the background transparency uh did i spell that right ah probably background transparency yes uh get frame is equals to uh zero wait 0 0.05 and now uh we're gonna copy a lot of code like zero point uh we, we do like well actually we do a way to 0.5 uh, 0 0.05 0 0.1 like that 2 3 4 5 uh, you just got to edit it by like adding 0 0.5 like this is going to be 25 3 uh, 35 40 45 and 5 uh and this is it, but now we're gonna copy and paste all the all these lines and we're gonna do if Kiko dot Q then we're gonna do fifty five well five uh, we're gonna disable this fifty five sixty uh well six sixty five seventy seventy five 80, 85, 90, uh, 95, and 1. Let's test this out. Alrighty, we're here. Uh, no errors. If we, if we click on E... We have the GUI, and after two seconds, it's gonna go like this. So you have your night vision, and if you press Q, it's gonna fade away. Let's test this again. E. Uh. Ooh. Uh. Yes. Frame dot back background transparency because it's zero. So it's always gonna start up a uh, zero. Uh, that was just my mistake. Uh, 
Alrighty, we press on E, boom, we get the frame, and then it's gonna fade until this, and if we press Q, it's gonna go, and if we click on E, we see it again. Now, this is just a really easy way to make a night vision for a game. Uh, in the next tutorial, we're gonna make it with a, a tool, so if you have, like, a tool, let me get, like, I don't know, is there something I can get real quick, like this, uh, yes, uh, can I get it, please? Yeah, over here. Look. We have this radio right here, and if you click on it, um, then uh, what we're gonna make it so um, you got probably maybe you get goggles on and you will um, get the same mechanism, but then with not keybinds. Um, if this helped you out, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tutorials from me. And uh, part 11 is gonna come soon um, for my jailbreak uh, tutorials. If you enjoyed, just don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace out. Goodbye.